Alrighty guys, and welcome back to what is most likely going to be the final episode of Radiant Historia Perfect Chronology. We are here to initiate the final true ending portion of the game. We need to talk to Nemesia, and she will lead us on our path. Maybe, just in case, heal up a little bit and get this oh, done. Oh, perfect timing. I picked up a reading on a new artifact. Oh, really? After the end, this artifact reading is coming from a world that has already ended. Could you go find it for me? Ready for your next assignment? Gotcha. The potential world I'm sending you to next is already dead. Wow, this is interesting. What do you mean? This is gonna be cool. A world where the desert has already consumed the continent and everyone in it. I think... I'm surprised we can go to a world like that. Or even that it exists in the first place. Anything is possible. We'll need the artifact there to save our own future. Can I count on you? You can count on me. Of course. I'll bring that artifact back. I promise. We're going on our last trip in our favorite rocket ship. After the end. In the end, it doesn't even matter. Hey, this is literally the opening scene of the game. This world really is dead. Everything has been swallowed into the expanse of sand. Finding the artifact here won't be a simple task. Oh, there's footsteps here. Wait, these are footprints. There must still be people living here then. Whose footprints? But who? Suppose following the prince is the only way to find out. Let's definitely save. Who's it gonna be? Take your bets, everybody. Take your bets. What the f... Selvan and Diaz? I can walk past them. What the... What are you two doing here? Our sworn duty was to serve the Granorg royal family. But when King Victor was killed and that wench took the throne, it all felt like a bad comedy. Then why did you push so hard for Protea? Why not support Erika instead? And yet that was an opportunity. Using that woman was our chance to gain true power and thereby help our country thrive. That's right. Our plan was to create the perfect utopia. So why? Why did this happen? There's a little point in trying to talk to them. They seem to be nothing more than illusions. In hindsight, 
the best of times were when Prince Ernst was still with us. But I'm still here. Sad, but true. Had he been around, things might have turned out differently. They're gone. I suppose that means they really were illusions. Hmm? The footprints don't end here, though. Protea. We're gonna see Protea, right? We're gonna see all the dead people. Reverberations in sand. Oh my god, it's Burgess. That's Galva, oh. the Patriarch of Forgia. Okay, I got I get I get the monkeys' names mixed up because they all look the same. I'm not sorry. The wounds dealt by humans should be mended by humans. That was a joke, by the way. That is why the Gutrums only watch from <laughs> the sidelines when we could have acted. And so we sat by while our home was swallowed by the sands. Leaving the world in human hands alone was a mistake. Who next, Elm? They faded into nothing, just like the other two. I suppose I should keep following the footprints. Elm is probably next. Elm, Elm, Elm. Any money. How much I want to take? How much I want to bet? Elm? Elm is next. Oh, it's Noah. No. Is that Noah? The citizens of Granorg were suffering from famine. Mm. Thaumatek engineering could have helped so many people, yet the king forbade its use. I founded Alistel to save lives. Never did I imagine my actions would ignite the flames of war. That is crazy. This dude only wanted to help people. He, he established a kingdom, or he established a city using tech to basically make lives better, and then... The war started because of that. That is messed up. I thought Thaumatek would bring peace, not so discord. I feel sorry for Noah, man. I only ever wanted to help people. Were it not for the desertification, this tragedy would have never occurred. Seem to be the emotions left by the affected by the deserts of dance. No time to think on it now. It might not be by much, but the artifact reading is steadily growing stronger. Seems following the footprints is the best way forward. Not much longer. We're like halfway through these footprints. Oh, and there they go. It's Elm and Vanos. Vanos. Elm. Once there was a Satyros who had faith in humanity, but he was killed by the very humans he believed in. He never should have trusted the humans. Nevertheless, he did. He thought that not all humans were evil. He learned some people could be friends, regardless of race. True. Although he knew betrayal was inevitable, he had faith in humans to the end. That's why. That's why we believed as well. But humanity repaid our trust with a world of death and sand. I have to wonder whether humans crave their own destruction. That can't be true, can it? There are still more footprints. Yikes. Who could be next? Stock is starting to feel them. Feels bad, man. Stock has to feel bad, man emote. Is Heiss. Heiss? Hmm? Who are you? You don't know who I am? Hmm. Why can't you remember? Hmm. <laughs> Everything is gone. I is he the only one alive? And he is he the one who created this destroyed world? My memories. My hatred. My sense of self. All disappeared. So this is the reality where he seceded 
Yet you're still here. Who are you? I... I can't remember anything. Is this the end you desired? You traversed history, time and time again. Rewriting the past. This is where you settle. Ah. I... I can't accept that. Heiss! You have to remember. It's me, Stark! Damn it! The artifact reading disappeared along with him. What can I do to bring Heist back to his senses? Gotta chase his ass through the time, huh? If only I had something that could rouse his lost memories. But what would that be? Heist's key. This key. Maybe it can help me find what I'm after. Henrik. Guess we're just running all the way back now, huh? Wouldn't that be crazy if there was like a hidden chest here? Like on the side? They give you like some secret ass dev kit item. I believe it. All right, so we're gonna save. And we're gonna go to Historia. We're gonna go to White Chronicle. Oh, wait, yeah, the fucking key to his desk, his, his drawer wouldn't open, that's right. That's right. Holy shit, I just realized that too. Yo, shout outs to Balfour, reminding me about that shit. All right, let's go. There is a there is a timeline where you have to search the castle and shit. It's not that one. Beyond Lost, Flux War, Ethereon. That's not it. Because I was wondering, like, you can never open his fucking desk. Can I just go back to the beginning and do it? There's, like, an area. Was it this one? I'm not sure if it was this one, but I think it's this one. Okay, yep. Okay. So I remember looking, trying to find a way to open his fucking desk. Oops, wrong office. Mm-hmm. Wait, that was the right office, wasn't it? Here we go. This is OD. Maybe the key I got from that illusion of heist would work here. This fucking one-time thing you were supposed to remember. Imagine not having any kind of hint. <laughs> you would just be looking throughout this entire game. There we go. This is a portrait of a naked lolly. Prince Ernst and his uncle Heinrich. That's Heist there, which means, is that me when I was young? This portrait must have been his precious mem uh, memory. Yep, <laughs> precious memento. Mementos, the fresh maker. Something with this much sentimental value is sure to bring Heist's memory back. Yeah, what about the Red Chronicle, though? We still don't know anything about that Red Chronicle. They never solved that. I guess that's probably what's going to be happening here. That's probably be the last thing we talk about. It's the Red, Con uh, Red Chronicle. Do I have people in my party? Yep, Gathka's with me. Yeah, I'm going to do this one last time. Look at that, man. 255. That's Square Enix's favorite number. Look it up. That is a fact. Square Enix is very infatuated with 255. It's funny because we have 255 subs on Twitch right now. And if you are sub to my channel, if you were gifted a sub to twitch.tv slash Sir Live, if you were gifted a sub to there, you could actually 
renew your subscription for only a dollar this month for September. You should do that because it'll give me the full effect. It'll be like giving me five dollars, but it's only one dollar. Anyway, enough of the shilling. Let's do some killing. By killing, I mean not actually killing, but killing time. Literally killing time. This is messed up that I gotta do this, by the way. At least, man, imagine not being able to skip any cutscenes. That would just be so horrendous. That would just be so awful if you couldn't skip cutscenes. Hey! Nice. My man QB Uchiha with the fresh Twitch Prime sub. Look at this, Heiss. My man, welcome to the Lion's Pride. Hmm. <laughs> Look at this photograph, Heiss. Do you still not remember? This is Ernst, my dear boy. That's right. You saved him from being sacrificed and gave him a new life as me, Stock. Stock. Ah, yes. But how can this be? You disappeared into the sand with everything else. Good to see you regained your memories. Now answer me, Heiss. Is this the end you wanted? Such empty, meaningless destruction? That's right. This is truly what I wished for. A world so cruel as to take my precious boy. It all deserved to turn to sand. Why must an innocent child be sacrificed in an insane ritual? I'd let the world perish before allowing your soul to suffer for eternity. Then again, you seem less than pleased with the outcome. Nice. But perhaps there was another possible outcome to all this. You came here from another world, did you not? How did you know? I mean, obviously. I accomplished my goal here, after all. I watched my stock turn into sand on the wind. Well, I suppose you're partially correct. It's more like I'm traversing a different possibility than the stock you were familiar with. <laughs> How intriguing, my boy. My boy. My boy. You were my possibility. My one hope and last redemption. That's why I will give you this. Is he gonna give me the Dark Chronicle? That, that'd be dope. The White Hourglass. Oh! Now go. Oh! Write the end you wish for. Show me a world where hope is still a possibility. Thank you, Ice. The end he desired. My man said, "Yeah, I, 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 I am under the weather Welcome today." Welcome aboard, Stock. <laughs> Hope you didn't get sand all over you. Bruh. Clean. Don't worry. Anyway, here. That was rude, Nemesia. His uncle just turned into sand, and you just said, "I hope you didn't get sand all over you." Damn. Rude. Thanks. That's another step closer to ending the desertification. Money? Really? You really think I need money? You think I really give a damn about money at this point in the game? So, what was it like? The only remnants of life were the residual emotions of those who used to live there. Now that I think about it, those emotions may only have taken form thanks to the artifact. So, it allowed you to connect with the feelings of those you're working to save. I hope so. Either way, I won't let my world turn into the wasteland that had become. <laughs> you get an A for effort. I honestly believe that one day, all your hard work will pay off. You're damn right, it better. I don't get an we A plus? We finally have enough. Gold stars for the both of us. So we can fix the Red Chronicle? Fine, you get a red X instead. The search is finally over, so you could at least act happy. <laughs> Wouldn't it be more appropriate to celebrate after the Chronicle is actually fixed? Sheesh, it's not as fun if I'm the only one celebrating. That aside, 
Does this mean we've gathered all the artifacts? Correct. After all this time, the artifacts are back together. Yeah, boy. It's a dream come true. Yeah, boy. At long last, the Red Chronicle will finally be back in my hands. Although the actual repairs will take a little more time. I'll leave that to you then. What should I do in the meantime? Can I help in any way? Thanks to you, we've got all the artifacts. But there's one more step to saving the continent. You mean beyond just repairing the Red Chronicle? Yeah. We'll need the cooperation of the Black Chronicle's holder. Yikes. That means finding a way to persuade Ice. All right. You can leave that to me. Thank you. I'm sure you can convince him to help us out. The question is... Will Heiss even listen to me? Key to the future has been added to the White Chronicle. You are my onk. Ah, uh, I know you. <laughs> you know. <laughs> You've returned, Stock. You are my uncle. Ah, uh, I know you. Know you man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't lie to my fucking mind. We have interesting news for Having you. too much fun. A new chapter has been added to the White Chronicle. Word? A new chapter? That's right. One that normally should not exist. But how? The ritual succeeded. My duty as a sacrifice should be no more. The presence of this addition is due to the actions you have taken on your journey so far. Hmm. I think I understand now. The desertification is still taking place. In other words, there's more for me to do. Indeed. It seems history isn't done with you yet. Now, proceed forth into this new possibility. Can I send my game first, though? Just in case, do you want to record your actions up till now? Goddamn right. Just in case, would you like to uh, save your game? Uh, duh! Let's get it! Let's get it, boys and girls! Historia. I return to the pivotal moment now to persuade, to persuade Heist to join our cause. Excuse me. <laughs> you fool. Why did you think I gave you the power to fight your fate with the White Chronicle? You greatly disappoint me. Ice, I need to request a favor. What, pray tell, would you ask of me after all that's happened? Please, listen to me. I need your aid in eliminating the cause of Vancouver's troubles. The cause, you say? You know well the tragedy that occurred in the Empire ages ago, and the ritual born out of it. Well, my plan will end any need for us to perform that ritual. That's what you've always wanted, isn't it? Hmm. Hmm. Tell me more. So, you hope to root out the problem from its source? Yes. But I need your cooperation. Please lend me your aid, Heiss. We were enemies but moments ago. Yet, now you ask for my help. You truly are a precocious boy. Thanks to you, Heiss. You gave me the White Chronicle. And the power to overcome fate. Fair enough. Let's talk outside. Finally, they're getting to the root of the problem. The root. Stock, you're back. The root of the problem, get it? Okay, we're done. And heist too? Heist too? What the fuck? Hold on, Rosh. Listen to me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill, bro. Chill. We need heist fighting alongside us for what's about to come. What's about to come? I'm about to come over there and punch him in the face. Look, Rosh. We all know you whack. We all know you weak. And that's why you never participate in any of these battles. All right? But I just need you to listen. Isn't the princess already going to perform the ritual and fix everything? No. 
We're going to create a world where we no longer need the ritual's power. Sounds good. But, uh, what are we doing exactly? We're gonna fight one more boss. Allow me to explain. Hey, Nemesia showed up. Nemesia? What are you doing here? Nemesia pulled up on the block. It's nice to meet you all. My name is Nemesia. Stock has been helping me out, and we've almost met our goal. We almost reached the stretch goal. That's right. That's right. In other words, you know how to solve the desertification at its source? That's correct. Through a series of Thaumatech experiments, the Empire of Old inadvertently created a monster. Like a black hole, this temporal beast drains the mana around it. It is known as the Singularity. So you're saying this Singularity is sucking up all the mana? Suck it, suck it. Wait, that's what's causing the desertification? Correct. But the Empire couldn't contain the monster they made. Thus, the Ritual of Flux was used to suppress its powers. <sighs> that's what the Ritual was all this time? I was told its purpose was to heal the Earth. To think this was the truth of the matter. <laughs> I'm beginning to see the big picture here. The means of defeating this temporal beast have only recently come to light, yes? Bingo. But doing oh, 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 oh. so requires all three magical tomes. Stock's White Chronicle, Heiss's Black Chronicle, and I'll need everyone's help to restore my Red Chronicle. I'm asking as well. Please, assist us in putting an end to this tragedy once and for all. Yes. Even I no longer wish to perform such a grievous ritual. This is real messed up because this ending wasn't in the original game. How do, how do you not have the original... How do you not have a complete co conclusion to a series that never got a sequel? <laughs> That's messed up. That's actually messed up, bro. No need to ask twice. We're all here to help stock well, out. Well, I'm glad I'm playing the uh, the training wheels version of this game. That's right. We'll fight by your side to the very end. Thanks, you guys. And you, Heiss? Will you offer us your strength? If it puts an end to this tragedy, then so I shall. All right. It's settled then. Let's immediately... Don't get ahead of yourself now. I will cooperate. But there are other matters I must attend to. Surely you don't need me to compile the Red Chronicle. True. We won't need your Black Chronicle until we're ready to face the Temporal Beast. Then I vow to rendezvous with you before the final battle, at the place beyond time. Very well. Okay, let's get to work on compiling the Red Chronicle. Follow me to the Dunamis. Intertwined destinies. Stock in this in the pick of destiny. That's right. Damn, we all on a boat. Wow, a boat. It's huge. Yeah, this is amazing. I wouldn't have guessed you've been taking off on a ship. Stock, you've been carrying the weight of the world all on your own, haven't you? Yeah, how about a little trust? Apologies. I wasn't allowed to tell anyone about this. It's okay, Stock. We could all tell something was up. But we had no idea it involved saving the whole continent. I knew all along. Stock's special. Of course. The Red One, I mean Stock, mended relations between beast kind and humans after all. Sounds like none of us would be here without Stock's help. Let's leave the thanks until later, though. We still have much to do here. Now, Nemesia, tell us what our next course of action is. Like I said, I need your help repairing the Red Chronicle. Sure, but don't you need some special know-how to deal with magical tomes like that? Not to worry. That's where I come in. Compiling a magical tome is different from a normal book, more so with the Red Chronicle. You could say we're turning the artifacts into pages and putting them back in the right order. Ooh. 
Uh, what? That yeah. sounds hard. Hmm. Maybe it's easier to grasp in practice than in theory. So let's get started. Everybody, all you have to do, right click, click copy, and then right click again and paste. That's all I need y'all to do. And here we are, the Chronicles Labyrinth. Uh, Whoa, what? this is Alistair. It just looks like Alistair to me. Whoa, this new music. <laughs> you get an F for judging a book by its cover. <laughs> so this isn't Alistair? This is the world as it was 50 years ago. We're in the past? It looks like this because this chapter of the tome covers Alistair's history. Then we can go to other places and times? Oh, that I'd like to see. I mean, wow, these magical tomes can work miracles. Long ago, the Red Chronicle was accidentally destroyed. As its unbound pages fell, they were transformed and scattered across many possible worlds. So, the artifacts I've been collecting were actually those transformed pages. The Red Chronicle is a tome for exploring possible new worlds. But to recompile the pages, we'll first need to repair the damage to the spine. How do we do that? Simply return the collected artifacts to this material realm within the Chronicle. Oh boy. By doing so, we'll be recording history as we go. Be on the lookout for book sculptures and treasure chests around the labyrinth. <laughs> Much like overdue library books, they have to be returned. Over there's a book sculpture. Oh, God. And that's a treasure chest. Oh, boy. I hope there's none that's invisible. To accurately record history, each artifact must be put back in its corresponding passage. Hopefully they do that automatically. Once the book sculptures have all their artifacts back, the chapter will be complete. So if you're pressed for time, prioritize the book sculptures over the treasure chest. Oh, here we go. Got it. The book sculptures are most important. Does that mean we can ignore the chests? We don't need them per se, but the more we fill in the blanks, the better off history will be. All right, we'll do what we can. Just to reiterate, we're 50 years before the present day. That's when the war between Granorg and Alistair started. So keep your wits about you. There should be three book sculptures. Let's look for them. Time to compile this chapter. All right, am I gonna be timed? The labyrinth has been added. All right, I'm not being timed. All right, I thought they were going to time my ass. Why is there a red chronicle up there? Nah, shut up, go to sleep. Oh, he was in the way anyway. I was really scared that- Why is Rosh in my party, bro? Heretic. Rosh, why are you here, bro? All right, I tell you what, just in case if these dudes are stupid head ass, I'm going all out. Uh, uh Muso. All right, here we go. We're going all the way out. <laughs> Yeah. All right. How about this? Didn't need to. Here's a special one. Ha! 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 this? Here's a special one. He did a sword rain. What about this? Must need an artifact. Hey, we take those. What does the Red Chronicle do? Huh? Huh? 
Huh? Huh? No, take me back. Okay. <laughs> take me back, dog. Take me back. Nah, we ain't messing with these guys. Hey. An unfixed sculpture. For this book sculpture, we need this artifact. Alistel was founded by a man named Noah. Really? His knowledge of Thaumatech turned the frigid north into a land of plenty. I didn't know that. Oh, what a troll! Let this be a fair match. What a gosh darn troll. So we're going to want to... Haste mode. And well, you know what? We're gonna steal. Here's a special one. There we go. Let's see what we get. You were a worthy opponent. Wow, you've gotta be kidding me. They give you shield herbs? Oh dude, this is easy. This is actually easy money. I think I'm because we want shield herbs, bro. Yo, that's kinda dumb. That's kinda dumb. I'm just saying. All right, so we kind of want your boy here. So when God strike, we're going to haste mode. Haste mode. Steal, steal. If only this game had memory command. Here's a special one. What the shield herbs do is basically block two attacks for free. Here's a special one. Which is really nice. Stolen item. Stolen item. Too simple. Shield herb plus. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh wait, wait, wait. Shield her oh okay. Alright, alright. I was tripping. Okay. Shield is shield seed and then there's shield herb. Okay, whatever. That's still really good though. Tourniquet. Yeah, Rosh is actually in the party. Oh, we can go in here. Nope, we cannot. Let's see where this goes. All right, so we want to put everything away. Guard down plus. They are preparing us for a fight. Yes. Now get your ass back. For this book sculpture, we need this artifact. There's only three of these, right? Not long had passed since the birth of Alistel before Granorg began to covet their prosperity. Granorg's army was marching on Alistel before its declaration of war reached Noah's hand. The Sand Fortress was built to fend off the impending invasion. I didn't even know this was a pathway. <laughs> Yo, 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 bro, 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 back up, back up before you get smacked up. All right, here we go. What we got here? Tenacity fruit, eh? Red horseshoe. Shield herb plus. Nah, get back, bro. I said get back. Let's backtrack to the other area. Well, I guess since we're here. Oh my god, no. I wasn't ready. Formation automatically complete? Nah, go to bed. This is what I'm gonna need you to do. When God strike, I'm gonna need you to do this. I'm gonna need you to do uh some haste mode and then I'm just gonna steal 
uh, uh. Mithril Knight. Too simple. Crescent Edge. Is that is that any better? Oh yeah, we did get like some armor for Erica too. Patriot. Okay, her magic defense goes down, but her magic goes even higher. And her defense goes higher. Her magic defense is already pretty pretty damn high. So I'm gonna give her that. The more magic, the better. Oh goddamn. For oh my god, that's actually really good if you want him to be magic based. I think there was another sword I got, but I never really looked at it. Valiant Edge cannot be sold. Marco, you don't even have magic though. Like that's the thing. You want more defense. So I guess just give him more defense. He does his attack, he ain't attacking. He he ain't ever attacking. Just give him defense. Crazy thing is. I feel like this is the best spear for your boy. If I unequip it, he loses all his fucking speed. Like, that's the saddest thing. That is sad. All my equipment currently gives some speed. <laughs> In order for, for Rosh to even be, like, straight, he needs this. Alright. An unfixed sculpture. For this book sculpture, we need this artifact. Red mask. Hey, it's the mask. 80 years ago, a terrible famine befell the kingdom of Granor. Noah strove to save lives with Thaumatech engineering. But the king of Granor forbade its use, dooming his subjects to sickness and starvation. And so, Noah took everyone who would follow and walked away. All right, that that was new. Looks like the path to the Hall of Binding has opened yeah, up. Yeah, we're not doing that. The path to We're going to get everything what? else. It's where historical events are compiled and set in stone. Now, let's go fix this chapter. All right, we're not going to do that yet. We're going to go look for chests in other areas. Looks like we can warp out of here. Nah, get back, buddy. Get back, buddy. Red Crest. Dude. Divine Water. We'll take it. Shut up. Shut up. Ooh, Panessia. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yeah, got him. Alright, so there was one right there. We got that. Does this take me back over here? Yes, it actually does. Alright, we just want to make sure we got everything. I think there's a little bit more to it. I'm also going to save the game. I, I feel like I can just easily... Oh, look at that. It says ending. It just straight up says ending. We're just going to loop around here. Yes. Get out of here, you bum. Yes. Yeah, we got everything, it looks like. All right, here we go. Nothing over here, nothing over there. Go straight down. We went to the left already. We never did fight you, huh? Come on. Here's a special one. Huh. 
<laughs> Delicious. What we get? A grand victory! And we level one up out here. Swerve. 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 All right. We might be good to go. I think we are good to go. We got every chest. We got every book that we can see so far. Oh my god, you bum. I lie, I cheat, I steal. We did it. Crescent Edge again. Thank you very much, guys. For the Crescent Edge donation. Hey, leave me alone. Alright. Anything straight down? Nope. Alright. Am I ready? What we want to do is go ahead. Superior T. Rosh. Gafka. Uh, by Rosh. I'm gonna bring in. I'm gonna bring in Erica. Because Erica is just strong AF. Alright. What the? <laughs> I apologize for that. Here we are. The Hall of Binding. What do we do now? We bind the halls. Your next test is to face history itself. Bruh. Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse me? Are you high? Here it comes. Heads up. What the? This is the history of war. Returning the chapter to the tome. Revive the war. History is literally repeating itself. It would have been nice for you to tell us like 10 minutes ago. The countless lives lost here. Their passion and pain is taking shape, crying out for blood. Such violence. The binder of the Chronicle must understand history's rage. Only then can you turn the page. Very well then. Here we go. Let's get it. Huh? 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 Why is Rosh in here? Why? <laughs> Rosh! Why are you in my party? I thought I switched you out for Erica. I guess. Oh no. All that shit I was talking about, Rosh, and now he's in. Oh no. Alright, we just gotta make it with what's due, man. I, I didn't even realize what I'd done. Oh my god. That's... That's gonna hurt. Alright, you know what? Magic herb. I don't even feel like I needed to use it here. I don't need to use that here. It's probably gonna be endless rounds of enemies. So you know, everybody just use AOEs. AOEs, AOEs. AOEs, AOEs. Uh, here I come. Oh, yikes. Eat this. Oh, oh. <laughs> Them cannons ain't playing, bro. Oh, this motherfucker's getting an attack boost, isn't he? Reduce damage. Mm -hmm. Okay. Rosh, I really don't... 
I don't like you, bro. Does he have an AOE defense down? Two frost this motherfucker. Ready? Yikes, yikes, yikes. Ooh, the support from Marco. Man, that was godlike. Take this. Whatever, just work on the cannons. Get these dumbass cannons out the way. Bro, you really think I'm about to let you do that? Rosh is actually gonna help here. Because he can do this. He can grapple. Head crush. G front. Oh, actually, aerial assault. G frost. Here we go. Uh uh. Way too slow. Grapple. Take this. Take this. Boom. G frost. Boom. Good damage. Mm, 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 mm. Damn, nice combo. The execution. Man, him and his bitch ass power zones. Hey, man. I gotta get my power zone on. So I just need to knock you to the right. Please tell me you can knock somebody to the right. Please tell me you can knock somebody to the right. what I'll do. I will go ahead and do that. Trans turn. I will knock you to the right. I'm going to launch you and that's going to be game good sir. I can't believe I have Rosh in my goddamn party. This is this is not what I wanted. This was not what was supposed to happen. This is not the cannon. How about this? That should be, that should be it. We've won. It's over. We've recorded the history of war into the magical tome, yes? That would be correct. When famine struck 80 years ago, Noah tried to save his fellow Granorgites. But the king of Granorg forbade Thaumatek engineering, and as a result, the people suffered. Noah and his followers went north to start anew, and so the land of Alistel was born. But as Alistel grew affluent, Granorg became jealous. So it has been recorded in the tome. So the starving citizens weren't enough? What a petty reason to finally change their minds. Still... I can't quite grasp why Thaumatech Engineering would have been forbidden. Hmm, I wonder. That question's never been answered, has it? Actually, I really... I would love to know why it was banned. Not in this chapter, anyway. We have at least two more to go. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Maybe it's on the next page. Let's keep reading and find out. Yeah, I guess we'll find out on the next episode. The true last episode of the next episode. So I will see you guys for the next episode of Radiant Historian. <laughs>